What's going on guys? Welcome back to Need for Speed Payback. We're continuing on with our daily episodes. Today, we are picking up where we left off. Last episode, we went and built this wide body Fast and Furious GTR. The thing was insane. We also have a bunch of like uh, part tokens to go and spend. We got 45 of them and I think we may need them today because this race, the one that we currently have right here, the Solar Sprint, it's the next race in the 1% Club thing. We need a car that's level 360. Our car is level 342, but I, I don't know if this is going to be super difficult. I'll give it a shot before we jump into anything. Drift for 3,200 yards and win the race. I'll try. Crew is starting to annoy me. Can't even take care of a nobody from nowhere. They lose this round, it's you and me. Oh shit, okay, we're already at the final. Or nearly at the Here final, I should say. Okay, we got me and Jesse, and everyone else is coming in hot in front of us. Oh man. Yo, Jesse. All right, so this is a 18-mile race. What? All right, well, I guess if we figure out that we're not going to win this thing, maybe, like, in a couple minutes, we'll quit out of it because driving 18 miles to not complete the mission is not cool. Like, what the hell are we doing? Oh, my God, we're actually doing, like, a complete, like, loop of the entire map, and it's all on the highway. So, I mean, it won't take that long to be fair it's seven minutes time on the right says which isn't crazy long but our car is not up to par for this just keep slipstreaming that's what i'm doing that's what i'm good at just keep going how the hell am i supposed to get drift yardage as there well we like i'm on a freaking highway yo look at my slipstreaming though um i found a glitch yo look at this once we get the speed on and we get the slipstream on everyone. We're really, really fast. We're, we're on medium difficulty because yesterday we had some bullshittery go on with the hard difficulty. So medium it is for us. Let's, let's get some drift angle in while we can. And get back to slipstream. Oh, never mind. We're on the wrong side of the highway. Yo! Unlock tire customization. Finally we get that. It's only taking us till 17th part. <laughs> Gotta keep it up. Oh my god, the exact same thing happened! Alright, so with this GTR, today I learned, if you hit a curb in the GTR, you will just die. We seem to have a pretty nice little safety gap, though, to uh, the guys behind, providing I continue to avoid the curbs, but this is going pretty well. I just want to get some more drift yardage up, which is proving to be more difficult than I originally anticipated for Break to Drift game. I wish we had some more NOS in this GTR, though. That is one thing I, I wish we could uh, focus on with some future upgrades, is, is some NOS, because only one bar of NOS is not great. There we go, look at that, already down to 500. Just with a couple more, like, just kicking the back out. That's it, and there's no one even behind. Hey, well, I'm just gonna say, this is a good way to uh, start up a Let's Play episode. Hell yeah, let me just get that final little yardage out. 26 yards left to drift, kick the back end out. Oh, that didn't happen, there we go. And that side bet is completed. What an incredible start to today's video. Like, hell yeah. Look at all the points on the top. We have two. 140,000 points chained up. That's a lot of points. That was honestly a pretty uneventful race. Like, we had the whole start, which was pretty intense. But after that, we were just fine. Awesome. And we destroyed the auto log time. Good drift yardage as well. Get 10,000 points. Money? I don't even know what the currency is of this guy. I always call it money. Anyways, 23 grand from that one race. This is how you roll in some money. I should say, I will soon have a full in-depth money guide. Either today or tomorrow. I don't know exactly when this video is going up. I've started to record my videos uh, in advance now, which is a good thing for me because it means I can chill. Uh, and I'm not so, like, rushed and, like, like stressed out to be like, Oh, I need to record a video the same day I upload it. Um, but yeah, anyways, we did that. That was awesome. Let's deposit those points lame, in. Lame, 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 You messed with the wrong HBIC, nobody. Let's do this. Maybe after I beat you, you can tell me what's really going on around here. Have you ever tried, like, being a different person? Maybe more people would like you. Says you! There's attention here, Natalia, and it's not me. Oh, spare me. What? Anyways, her race is all the way up here. We are going up against that Pagani. It says we need to be level 380. That is asking a lot. Shall we just give it a go, though? 
and just see what happens. Anyways, I just wanted to give you guys a massive thank you because you know how we released these new AR-12 toques on the store the other day? Well, on the day they came out, we honestly nearly sold out of all of them, which I was not expecting. We smashed all the records on the store. I actually went and ordered some more of them because I just wanted to give you guys the opportunity to get these hats because they are pretty cool. Um, so if you would like them, you can get them still on the store and get them while you can because I honestly don't know how long they're gonna last. You're but to yeah, the thank you guys so much for smashing the store. I love when you trash talk. It's just talk and the trash comes with you. What a chirp. Like, honestly, what a chirp. Oh, your, your, your thing is slow. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're dead. You deserve that. Oh, no vehicle collision. I wasn't paying attention to my side bet. All right. Let's uh, try not to crash into her car. We can weave in front of her to get her to slow down. I just don't want her to crash into me. That's the thing that I'm honestly kind of worried about right now. She's going to bump into the back. Natalia versus the nobody. Well, you're currently in second place. I would just like to let you know. Slow down, slow down. Grind the wall. Don't hit anyone. Did Natalia hit someone? No! How did you get through there without hitting anyone? Okay, you're pretty fast. Your car's just stupid fast. Slow start for nobody. Let's Wait see a if slow you start for. Fast enough to get that Flintstone mobile moving. Well, I lost my side bet. Do I think I can catch her up or do I restart? I feel like I could catch her. This is another eight mile race. Like, to be fair, these, these final races were getting really good money from them, but they are long races. Like, there's a lot of driving involved. Man, I just cannot catch up this final, like, maybe 150, 200 yards. I cannot close it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna restart. I didn't feel like it was gonna happen. And we can focus on not crashing into the, the traffic. Oh, oh, she's gone. She went down the wrong path! Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, I just had a huge crash with, with Nova. And, uh, turns out, uh, she crashed. And, uh, looks like I'm gonna win now. I don't think there's gonna be any way that she's gonna catch us up. So, we're good. We got a nice little Sunday drive for the final two miles of this race. Hell yeah! I guess while we make the final two mile drive, uh, I can let you guys know about a little bit of a giveaway we're doing. You might know no all these way. new AR-12 stickers ridiculous. like the Galaxy ones. Uh, the snow stickers, or even like the AR-12 gaming decals. Well, uh, we're teaming up with some guys over at Sticker Mule to produce those stickers, and we're actually doing a pretty cool giveaway with them. We're going to be giving away some AR-12 sticker packs, as well as $30 to the Sticker Mule store. We're going to have 10 winners, so there's going to be a bunch of guys, and you can enter. Links down below. Good luck. Yes, I did have a couple of crashes that race. Primarily one into... Nova. 150,000 XP. That is insane. Speed car in the middle. I'll take that. Sure. Exhaust level 18. That's the highest level exhaust we could have got. That's crazy. Our, our, our car now, our GTR, is over a thousand horsepower. 1% club has been defeated. We get a McLaren in the dealership. Okay. That should be awesome. A Dodge Viper. Oh. You guys know I've been waiting for the Dodge Viper for quite a while now. We get the Audi R8, my personal favorite car in this game. I would- I think that's probably my favorite car in this entire game. Anyways, that went really, really well. Okay, we get an achievement, Natalie Nova. You know, I am. At least I used my own skill to win. You know what I mean. I may not be able to stop you from getting into the rush, but you can bet your saggy ass that I'll do everything I can to stop you during it. But have fun with your pipe dream. You have no clue what you just stepped in. Why are they so mean? Natalie's just a bitch. Anyways, um, I mean, we've got this drag racing stuff to do up here. Do we want to do some drag racing or start some off-roading up? Kind of want to start some off-roading up, and we got some good money, so... We, we should we should look at a dra or, a, or an off-road car. Level 310 we need. Let's head to the off-road dealer and see what we can get. We've got some serious amount of cash now. So we've really got options for anything, really. My problem is, though, is that I just don't know what to buy. Like, we could get that. We can get an Evo. Evos are awesome. There's no real supercars in, in off-roading. So we're going to need to go with something like probably a Porsche Panamera Turbo or... No, we'll probably go with the Porsche Panamera Turbo just because it's already much faster. Is that really the fastest off-road car I can buy? Oh my god, it is. Seriously? 
The Panamera is the fastest off-road car. I don't care though. Like I said before, I don't want to get screwed over like I did before. Porsche Panamera Turbo it is. We'll do some upgrading. And let's see. Uh, I guess first we can go start it up with some garage stuff and uh, make it look all cool. I just love how much money we're getting right now. Like we have 150k in the bank still. And I mean, we've been spending quite a bit of money recently. Like we bought a GTR. We bought the Jag F-Type. We bought the Porsche Panamera. There's a lot of stuff that we own. It's kind of crazy. Anyway, so off-road car. What do I want to do with it? I've not built this car in this game yet, so I don't really know what's available. So do we want some big vent hoods? Yeah, I guess sure. Why not? I mean, we've got some money to spend. We might as well make this thing look kind of unique. Let's, let's do it. That looks like a Ferrari front end, can I just say? Get some more vents in there. We'll make it look very race car. Actually, I don't like that hood anymore. Yeah, let's go back to the normal hood. Normal hood looks nice. Kind of a boring car to, to customize, if I'm honest. Okay, apparently we're just not going to fill up with gas anymore. That's that's cool. Uh, tinted taillights. Oh, whoa, those look really cool with the black in there. Those actually look like McCann uh, headlight or taillights. All right, what do we... <sighs> chassis mount on a, on a Panamera. It's not a bad choice. I don't know if the active arrow works on this car. Because if it does, I kind of don't want to put the uh, put a rear wing. Rear bumper. Can we put something cool on? Uh, I guess we'll put ones with some vents. Sure. I'm just putting parts on to put parts on right now. Like, it's not even looking particularly cool. Oh my god. I have an idea for this rear. Let's keep it like that. Uh, let's keep it all lifted up because we're going to be off-roading, so that's going to help us. Let's just get a paint and we'll be good. So, let's keep this going. We got to go do some performance parts, and I mean, we've got a bunch of, of parts that we can actually swap onto this thing. Before we head to the part shop, Ah, oh, shit. We left the garage. Um, I just want to go take my old parts off the our GTR, just so I don't forget. So our old performance parts. Like, yeah, we just have some old ones from from those races that we, we won. Obviously, we got speed cards from that. So let's just swap out our old parts here. Okay, so everything on this Panamera is level 8. So let's do some spins, see what we can grab. Actually, you know what we should probably do? Maybe we should start Please off by spinning of for a brand. Because then if we get everything like the same brand right from the start, we'll get a huge boost. So you know what? Because we just got Americana brand there. Let's spin for Americana brand again. All right. So we pick up an ECU with a nice little brake boost. Like, see what I mean? Like, these parts are going to start to work together and really, really boost us up. So let's go Americana again. I think we should be pretty good. Anyways, all we have to get to for this thing right now is level 310. So that's not bad. But you can see those boosts getting applied now. That's really, really good. Awesome. So we're level 10, level 10, level 10. We've got 50-50 chance of getting the parts that we, we don't have just yet. So let's keep going for Americana brand here. I think it's worth it. Level 9 part. I wish we got some higher level part stuff though. That is the one thing that is bothering me. Like, we're level 16 in this game. We are now at the end of the game. I don't know if they just want me to pour like all of my part tokens into one car to just do some races, but it's getting really frustrating that we're just not getting good parts. We get an exhaust. Do we have an exhaust before? I don't think so. So that's level 10 now. That is awesome. Okay, so sweet. Like, look at that. It's almost all Americana brand. Let's just get rid of that old one. So if we can get a block that is Americana brand, that would be so sick. Please just give me a block. I got a block with a nitrous boost and a bunch of upgrades. That's going to be, oh my god, look at all those boosts I got. Although our car is not level 310, that is an incredible start. I feel like this car may be up to par for uh, for whatever these guys are. Got. Hazard Company. Yo, look at our NOS. Our NOS is so good. Oh, this is awesome. We have a good car today, boys. We're no longer stuck in the G-Class. Look, it slides. It it can turn. Ah, oh, we did good. I like this car a lot. All right, let's start this up. Hicks to the core, but I can guarantee we live better than you. Cash in our hands, dirt in our toes, and nothing but the sky in front of us. Oh, yeah. We are Hazard Company. I like Hazard Company. They're just cool. They got cool cars. Also, I really want to go to that NASCAR track again that we, we raced around in last episode. That would be so sick. Hello, Mr. Hazard Company guy. Wondered yeah. when I'd see you around these parts. Expecting me? Of course. I was looking forward to meeting the fabled off-road maniac, Sean McAllister. How about make it to the airfield in a jiffy? 
that'll be the test. I can probably get to the airfield in a bit of a jiffy. Solid shout out to the AR-12 stickers. Get them. Link is down below. And you can put them on your car and make it look like Need for Speed. That'd be pretty cool. Anyways, we just gotta get to the airport. We have to drift 2,100 yards because I took the side bet there. Let's see how, how doable this is. Now this Panamera, just from driving through before, like, we were getting some pretty good drifting out of it, and I wasn't really trying to. So if we can keep that up, that'd be good. Like, look at that. Our drifting's already coming down. One thing that needs to be worked on, I will say, in this game, is the collision boxes whilst you are off-roading. Sometimes they are not where you think they are, and it will cause you to screw up. Anyways, 3.5 miles. At least we're done with the 18-mile race event, so that's awesome. This event should only take us 2 minutes and 30 seconds. We're about to level up to level 17. I want to get this side bet done, though. We gotta keep pushing. Oh, the wing's open! The wing is so sick, I didn't even realize it opened. Oh, when we slow down for corner... Okay. We'll see it close and open. What a car! Oh, I love this thing! Why did we not do this before? Alright, we're nearly at the airfield. Good, sir. We still got a minute to go. And one mile. Actually, less than a mile now. Hell yeah. I really want to see my wing close, though. And it's just like, we're not slowing down enough to see the wing open and close, but... It's pretty cool. Oh my god. This is such a good car. Come on, please level me up to level 17. Oh, big jump! Hey, buddy. Oh shit. Solid drift across the line. We did good. We are doing very, very good today. Drifted for nearly 3,000 yards. I think we've properly done a couple miles of drifting this episode. Like, that's really cool. 23k from that. Our Panamera is already paying for itself. This thing costed, what, it was 130k? So if we can make that up, that would be sweet. Anyways, we level up. We get a speed card as well. We get a new head, level 12. Is that an improvement? That is an improvement. It does ruin our brand sort of reputation, but we will grab that and start moving up. So we've got six events for Hazard Company. Okay. Damn. That might be the fastest split time I've seen in this run. I'm sure you're just saying that. I don't blow smoke. I can see why the other crews had trouble. Now you're gonna have the time of your life with us, though. You've never had races like the ones you're about to have. After Free Ember Militia, I've seen more crazy than is possible. Crazy, huh? We're meeting at my solar array next race. You in? I'm in, buddy! Anyways, I guess we should go start this race and try it out. Going, Mac? <laughs> Weird, Ty. First impression of Holtzman? Not an asshole. I know, what? right? I was, was just meant to say that. He, know, he's not he's not a dick. Threw me off too. Sure, okay. Well, just keep an eye on him. Yeah. Yeah, see? People who put AR-12 stickers on their cars are cool people. Alright, so let's see this wing action. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. That is so awesome. Opens and closes. We'll see it right off the start line here. All right, side bet. Stay in the air for a total of seven seconds and win the race. We get 10 grand. Like, the amount of money we are pulling from these events now is insane. Be a rough one. Stay wild out there, crew. Just the way I like it. Okay. I like this. I like these wild ones. So, is this a point to point race? It is a point to point race. Let's go and try to catch up to these guys and overtake a bit. We got a Panamera friend. Sorry, buddy, for the. Early crashes, we're already up in the fourth place. Get some get some slipstreaming in if I can. I don't know how well it works off-road, but I'm gonna try. Yo, we got Dale! Dale Earnhardt Jr. No, Dale, you blocked me with all your all your sand and dust and stuff. Yo, but look at this though. We're back up to fourth place, and these guys are just right here. Even with our crash into the house, thanks Dale for that. We're doing good! Also, I've nearly got my airtime thing done. Still pushing. Bobby Joe. Shit. Just say hi. Tess, no, Tess! Why? Everyone crashed there. I think every single person. Yeah, everyone crashed. I'm in second place. Yo, but it looks like it's just me and Peach. Everyone else had crashes. As soon as we went through that tight bit, there was like three of us all who crashed straight into each other. Come on. Less than a thousand yards. We're nearly there, Mackie boy. This is going really well. I don't know where the beetle is. The beetle seems to have dropped off the pace. Drive along the train tracks, keep us fast. Our Panamera has definitely seen better days, but it is so fast. I I don't get how this thing is so fast. We destroyed the auto log time. We we got so much air time. Another 10 grand from that. We're 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 good. Gearbox level 11 is that an improvement? Yeah. Uh, 
Not really, actually. Anyways, we are two of six missions uh, through the way for the Dust Devils uh, and Holtzman's crew. That is that is going really, really well. I, I have been awarded a shipment, so let's open these up uh, before we finish off today. But, uh, you know, we've got three base shipments? For what? What did I do? For he's a jolly good fellow. 25k, three part tokens, hell yeah. Another, another shipment, all right. 15k, purple underglow, six part tokens. This is really good. We are making so much money. Hey. Oh, I did it, I did it, I did it. <laughs> we get the rarest part in the game. I always thought the rainbow nitrous was the rarest. It's actually the air suspension. About time. So we get that, we get 10k and three more part tokens. Anyways, guys, I am going to wrap this up here. That was one hell of a video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you subscribe down below for more. I will see you back here tomorrow. Same place, same time. Don't forget to buy an AR-12 hat and unleash your inner Canadian. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!